Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create any of the soft close physics in iClone 7. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. Alright, first you go and download the Blender. Blender is a free software. Download the Blender for free and then open the Blender. Then after that you click here Select the three objects, the, the light, the cube, and the camera, delete them, delete all of them. Because we just want to create a curve at here, just click add, add a mesh, add a plane. That's all. And then here you go to the edit mode. You right click, subdivide, right click, subdivide, and right click again, subdivide to make sure it have enough, enough poly, enough faces all right after that you can see now you have a lot of faces here then you can just export it out export as fbx all right so now click file export fbx as demo i will just export on my desktop and name it as clove Then here I choose copy, you tick and select it, export the FBX file. So once you already export it as FBX file, if you double click, it will open with the 3D viewer, it still looks like a plane. But now we are going to import it into iClone 7. Alright, everything just start from the scratch. I open the iClone 7, I start a new project, and I don't save it. Now. I'm going to demo step by step. How am I going to do this? Alright, now this is iClone 7. I will drag the cloth FBX into here. And then you can see this is just a plane. I can drag it up, I can drag it down. The most important thing you come come to here, the two side, you take it, take the two side, and then you make it up. You can just press R to make it bigger. Press W, you can drag it up. Next, most probably you want to drag a you want to drag a shape. You can just go to the prop there, go to the prop 3D blocks. You can select one of the shape from here. For example, I will select this, this cylinder, drag in and put it here. And after that, after that, once you click play, it won't simulate anything, but you need to do something. You press Q and double click the cloth. At here, you can change the color of the color of the cloth here. Let's say if you want you want to have a green color, you can just change the, the color, the diffuse color. This is the plane. Or change it to any any color. Let's say I want to change it to become a darker color. Next, you go to there. This is the physics. Activate the physics and select soft cloth. And, and then you play, it will drop, but it still penetrate through here. So click here, it back to the frame one. You press Q and double click, double click the prop that you, you want to select. And then you also go to the physics there, activate the physics. As a rigid body, you choose static and untick the object gravity. Now you try to play. Now you can see it is totally simulated, but the shape is not fit as well. What you need to set is just scroll down. The bounce type, you, you select the convex who Now you can see this is a cube shape we don't want. We want it to follow the shape of the mesh. Just select from here, select the convex tool. Now, when you try to play, it will automatically follow, follow the shape there. But you can see it still have some of the penetration at there. We don't want this to be happened. So what you can do is just double click the, the soft glove there. And then you go to the physics again. Just scroll down. 
this one the margin the soft rigid collision you set it up to the tree up to three then it will be better you can see if it is two it still can penetrate a little bit there by default it is 0 0.01 it penetrates right so you select once just adjust one by one to see what type of the effect that you want it to be if two still not okay change it to become three it will be better all right now it become a soft soft cloth physics already if you change the shape here or you just rotate it it will automatic follow it as well you just have a look to see whether it it will cover or not play now you can see some of the penetration there you can just fix it by double click the cloth and then go to the physics again you increase the margin the soft versus rigid collision up to five it will be better now we can see this is a perfect cloth perfect soft cloth cover now this one i may just put it up this one up again it will simulate simulate very well this one if i make it bigger you play all right you can see this simulation is really well it, it will automatic fit into the shape and drop like a cloth when you do the 3d animation you can just make this type of the simulations when you play it have have some certain mass at there it is really awesome this is the way how to, to set any of the soft cloth right there all right that's all for today about how to create any of the soft cloth step by step in icon 7 when you are doing the 3d animations it is really awesome it automatic fit to the to the object shape and it have certain collisions and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3d animation and game developing you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time i publish a new video tutorial you will receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy happy animation and game developing. See you.